Yo, still Mills, what's the deal, man? Peep game, though. I don't know why this fight ain't getting talked about in the capacity that it should be. Because I think this this fight is a, is, a, is, a, is a hell of a fight, man. Um, Connor Ben versus Adrian Granados. Like, nobody is... I ain't seen no breakdowns on it. I ain't seen no hype up. You know, nobody bigging it up, no nothing. Nobody talking about it on no forums. It's just... It's getting put to the back burner by everything else, man. I'm like, yo... Me personally, I'm 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 becoming a huge Conor Ben fan, man. I think that dude is the you know the dude is the goods, man. Um, he's a dog. I think that's mainly you know I think that's the big. I think he's one of the cats who would have success in the North American market because of how he fights. He comes to fight. You dig that nigga's a dog, man. Like he ain't you know ain't shit sweet. He come in a brawl. And I think with him and Adrian Granados, it's really gonna he's really gonna be able to showcase that. You know, um I just went and watched him in um Formella and how he was how he was fighting, he's putting he's entertaining the folks, man. Like he's entertaining the people with how he fights. Cause he's coming to he's coming to rumble. He's coming to rumble, man, and uh so is Adrian Granado, so you most definitely not gonna be bored watching that fight. That's most definitely a fight. You're gonna be like, yo! You gonna talk about that fight. You're gonna look at the highlights afterwards and some more shit. You that's a fight that's you're gonna get up out your seat for, man. So I just don't understand why nobody's really talking about it, man. But as far um as far as a breakdown between the two of them, man, I think um Man, I think it's a pick 'em fight. Uh, nah, I don't. But um, I think um, one of them will be there. Each one of them will be there to be knocked out, or hurt, or or whatever you want to call it. If you know what I mean, it's a lot of people who say, "Oh, he he ain't really getting knocked out. He you know he was out on his feet. The ref stopped him. The cut stopped the fight. Whatever. It still goes down as a knockdown, man. So both of them will be there to be put in that situation. Both of them will be there to be stopped. Both of them will be there to be cut. Both of them will be there to be knocked out, knocked down, whatever the fuck ever. It's going to be a brawl in there, man. I just think, um, and I think, uh, you know, when you look at Adrian Granados, man, that dude is a workhorse, man. He, he comes to fight. Volume puncher, hard puncher. Really no, really nothing that stands out about him. Like, yo, outside of his heart and his will to win. And him just really being a workhorse and going in there to fuck you up. <clears throat> and um with uh Connor Connor Ben, I think he has a pretty big upside, man. I think um, you know, it's it's, it's he's most definitely a lot slicker between the two of them. He's he's most definitely a lot slicker between the two of them. He um faster hands, better feet. You dig better head movement, but um, the way both of them fight, either one of them can go in there and get knocked the fuck out. I mean, look at how fucking uh, Adrian Granados did a Miri Mom. Now, granted, that was some years ago and some wars, some wars ago, but nonetheless, he was able to eradicate a dude who had like after that, we you know, you barely hear about it, Miri Mom. You dig because people was just like. It was a Mary Mont. He got knocked. He got stopped by Adrian Granado. So, you dig? I don't think that should have been a knock against him, man. And he just hasn't been able to get his feet back under him since that loss. But, um, each, both of them will be there to be hit. Both of them will be there to be hit. And both of them are willing to take the shot, to give a shot. When you, when I was watching Sebastian Formella versus, uh, uh, Connor Ben. He was literally, he would eat a shot and go and get and answer that back in combination and value, man. Um, and that's where I think he, because it with him, Connor Ben, you know, I think he's slick defensively, but he does get a little bit, he gets wide in the, you know what I'm saying, when he's in the pocket, you know, and he drops his hand a little too low in the pocket and it causes him to get hit, you dig? Even when he go, you know, after he gets done moving his head and he goes to back, goes back to advance and he was still getting clipped with the jab, you dig, flush, flush, you dig, and if Sebastian had respectable power, 
that fight would have been a lot different. And when you look at Adrian Granados, he has the power to really gain and garner your respect. So I think that would be something that he should work on. He didn't get an opportunity to work on it with Samuel Vargas because how, how fast he got him up out of there. But nonetheless, you know, you grow after every fight. If that's, you know, if you're still in a position of where you're able to learn and adapt to your game, you dig? So I think um, that's something that could be problematic when you're dealing with a cat like Adrian Granados because as slick as Amiri Mom was, he just didn't let off of the gas. And if you ain't got the gas, I mean, that takes that takes energy to sit there and slip and dip and bend at the waist and everything. And when you're getting into the 10th, the 9th, 10th, 11th, and 12th round, if you know, if you ain't got that tank, you know, you 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 getting stepped on. So I think um that could be a problem for him right there. However, I gotta go with Connor being in the in the fight, man. I think, you know, he had you know, it's a lot of um it's a lot of it's it's a lot more in Adrian Granado's game than it not Granado's but Connor Ben's game than it is Adrian Granado's game. And when you watch Adrian Granado's versus Adrian Broner spinning off the rope, you dig spinning them in the middle of the ring, footwork, that shit works again. You know, that shit can it works against them. It flusters them. It flusters them. Get a few shots off and get out of the way. And Connor Ben is a really, 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 really good counter puncher, man. I just think um he can get time with the counters also. You dig because he loads up a lot. He loads up a lot on those counters, man. So it's a few things. It's a it's a it's a few it's a few holes in this game that could be exploited. But I don't think uh, 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 um, Adrian Granados. I don't think he has the requisite well, skill set to do it. So I, I I I'm thinking Connor Ben is going. I think Connor Ben is going to win the fight. You know. I think he's gonna win it unanimously, unanimous decision. I think, um, yeah, he just he has he has more skill. He has you know he's a little bit more polished than Adrian Granados, but I wouldn't count Adrian Granados out. You dig? I mean, the dude is a, like I said, he's a workhorse and he's not coming in there to lay down, especially to some pup, especially to some pup, and that's what's gonna make it dope because he's not coming in there to lay down, and Connor Ben is coming in there to prove himself because he didn't. You dig? He had a you know nobody stopped. Sammy Vargas the way that he did but it's still not enough for people people still aren't enough uh, 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 Virgil Ortiz was able to make a career or make a name off of how he did Samuel Vargas and Connor Ben hasn't I, I'm sure that doesn't sit well with him so he's looking to come in here and make a statement he's most definitely looking to come in here and make a statement and I think that's what he's gonna do against Adrian Granados man and yeah, that's how I feel about it. I just, I, I think, I, I just think he's more polished. I think he's more polished. I think you know the better, the sharper counter puncher, hard hands. Like that kid can punch. He, he's gonna, he's gonna feel those counters. He's gonna feel those counters. He's gonna feel that jab. He has a good jab. He works well off the jab. Jab upstairs, jab downstairs. Good head movement, man. Like the kid is nice. Like niggas is real life gonna stop hating, man. The kid is nice. The kid is nice. He gets busy in there, man. I, but I do think um. Oh, that's my mom. But I do think he's gonna be the I think he's the better, the better man in the fight. So that's how I'm feeling about it, man. Like and subscribe, let me know what y'all think, man. Peace.